We're really far from the Persinium. Super far. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna call an Uber. Calling an Uber? I'm gonna call an Uber. Heck yeah. Uber. <laughs> Good app. Hit it. Good man. app. Good app. CCA Uber, dude. It's here, man. Uber, baby. Uh, how are you? Nice to meet you. Hi, guys. Hi guys. Hey, uh, let's not talk during this Uber ride, okay? I'm not a, I'm not a talker. Yeah, Uber. Okay. Oh, you okay. Sounds good to me. Happy Friday, CCA. We're here in the Presidium to watch the 2017 Oscar nominations and to prepare for tonight's Mini Cine Fest. Yes, definitely come to Mini Cine. Also, just get some popcorn, grab a date like my man Danny. <laughs> ladies, ladies, quiet down. It's movie time. Anyway, I'm Gabe. I'm Naveen. And, and this, this is, is CCA, CCA TV Night, Night at, at the, the Movies. movies. I'm Hannah, this is CCA on, and we're asking students about their opinions on the Oscar nomination. Can you try to guess any of the nominations for Best Picture in the Oscars? La La Land. I'm sure La La Land will win. La La Land. La La Land. Have you heard about the Ryan Reynolds, Ryan Gosling feud? No, I didn't know that's a thing. No, but that sounds amazing. Amazing? But it's a feud. Two hot guys fighting. <laughs> Two hot guys fighting. So I have spotted our APs. <coughs> what do you think was the best film presented in 2016? I do have to say Moonlight actually was a very good one. I, I saw it recently. Did you see it? I didn't. <coughs> I have to say... La La Land, Ryan Gosling. So Moonlight. In short, yeah. Photos by the bee. There in the sand, or through the barrel of the ocean water. A click, a clack, a zoom, a snap, a look in somebody's eyes. Photos of guys to open the world and send a railing. Rat tat tat on my heart I just want you to take photos Newborns at the beach I'm Nate Barnes and I'm a photographer and artist who's been practicing photography since about 8th grade 
and art my whole life. My artwork consists of digital manipulations of pictures, straight original Photoshop pieces, drawings we've done on physical paper. When I'm doing my art, motivation really comes through the ocean, nature, urban settings, really just kind of drive me to like create cool pieces based off of the world around me. Me and my friend Dustin Gill have been starting up this company called Crystal Garden, and it's a collaboration of mine and his artwork which is going to be eventually put into t-shirts on the 16th. You can contact me through Instagram at Navy Photos or email natebarnes99 at gmail. So what inspired us to actually plan Community Day was the experiences of each of the pals three years ago and how they had experienced Challenge Day. What we wanted to do was take something similar to what Tory Pines had did and done and they created Falcon Fest and we wanted to create CCA Community Day in an effort to create a challenge day specifically catered to the students of CCA and what their needs are. The overall goal of Community Day is, is in its name, which is to make sure that the community that we have stays a community. Um, what does that mean? You know, friendship and, and a caring environment and an uh, environment where people can be, feel free to be who they are and what they want to be. Everybody in the room at the end it felt like a family. We all connected in so many ways and it was also such a gradual transition from really fun activities in the beginning to more meaningful, more deeper connections and discussions. Community Day is um, a fantastic way to not only open up to your peers, but to get, know, get to know everybody on a personal level. Thank you to everyone that was able to attend our event this year and we can't wait to see you all next year. What you, what you looking at me like that for? Come on, man. You just drove down here? Yeah. Like you were just on one, and you hit the highway? Yeah. I'm trying to get to Mini City. Hey, Pa. Why you never like sports? What law says I gotta like sports? None. Okay, so don't you play sports every day? Answer me when I talk to you. Don't you play sports every day? Yes. As long as you're in my show, you put a sir on the end of it. You got a basketball? Yes, sir. You got a basketball? Yes, sir. You got a soccer ball? Yes, sir. You got a jersey on your back? Yes, sir. Now, why do you think that is? Because you like sports. <laughs> <laughs> I love sports. As winter sports are just coming to an end and spring sports are right around the corner, this season is going to be packed with sports. This is the first time they're letting two girls host. And with Audrey just coming out of ACL surgery, we're going to have to be informed and know what we're doing. Audrey, do you have the scores for this week? Mm -hmm. Audrey! Who am I? Where are we? You have to film? Oh yeah, because I'm a movie star. Yep, you are. I'm Aaron. 
And I'm on pain meds. And, and this, this is sports. sports. Boys basketball finished their league season with seven wins and three losses. Girls basketball concluded their season with a league record of eight and two. Boys soccer also had a good run this season with six wins, two losses, and two ties. Congratulations to all the teams that made it into CIFs. We know you're going to do great. Don't worry, sports aren't over. Spring sports are right around the corner and tryouts are happening now. If I try out for all of them, I'm sure to get one. That's it for this week, CCA. We'll see you next time on Sports. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed those films. And don't forget, Mini Cine is here in the Presidium at 7 p.m. Tickets are $5 for students, $10 for adults, and all the proceeds help fund CCA TV. So come out and see some awesome films created by and starring some of your classmates. Till next time, stay, stay cinematic, cinematic, CCA. CCA. Thank you.